Hello everyone, welcome to SQL Guide. Today we going to discuss SQL Server memory detail. Suppose one of the SQL Server having performance issue and SQL Server not performing well. You are DBA. What is the first action you need to perform? Memory is one of the biggest resources of a SQL Server. Low memory condition can slow the operation of the application and services on your system. Keep the good amount of memory can help SQL Server to run fast and reduce reading from disk. Performance Monitor Memory uses for a SQL Server instance and monitor overall memory consumption. You need to monitor three server resources, CPU, memory and disk. Let's connect with SQL Server Management Studio to show you SQL current memory, SQL max memory, total OS memory and available memory. Sys DM OS Sys memory, Sys DM OS process memory, Sys DM OS Sys info. This three dynamic management view help you to figure out memory issue in a SQL server. So this three mem uh, dynamic management view is very useful to figure out your SQL server memory issue. First, Sys DM OS Sys memory. This query help to get a operating system memory. Let's run it. Sys DM OS Sys memory. Let's run it. Available physical memory is high, then it's good. You no need to worry. Here you can see available physical memory is a high. So, this DM OS is memory, total memory OS is 4005 MB, available memory is 862 MB. Now, second, this DM OS process memory, this dynamic management view help you to get information SQL Server process running on the operating system. Let's run the query this DM OS process memory. You can see that physical memory in a huge by SQL Server is a 93 MB and physical memory is low and virtual memory low is a zero. If both value are zero then you are good then you have a good memory if value is one then you need to be in investigate the memory issue so this query this dmos process memory this query help to get information memory low issue or not now last this DM OS is info. This memory, this dynamic management view help you to get information memory committed to SQL Server and a need of memory. So this is very important because it going to tell how much SQL Server committed the memory and how much memory need SQL Server to commit information about the computer and about the resources available and consumed by sql server this dm os this info let's run this query this dm os this info you can see that sql server committed memory is 227 mb and requirement is 1000 113 MB. So this is the, the by this you can project your memory 
and you can figure out that currently committed memory is a 227 MB and the requirement is a 1100 1113 MB. Let's rerun all this query same time and figure out if any memory issue with SQL Server or not. You can see here SQL committed memory in MB is 227 MB and the requirement is a 227 MB and the available memory we have 857 MB it means we have an enough memory so this SQL Server instance currently no memory issue so you can see here last this DM OS this info SQL committed memory here showing 227 MB and target committed memory in MB here 227 MB okay and sysdm OS sys memory will tell you total memory in OS and available memory in OS so available memory it is showing 857 MB and total 4005 and the SQL server need 227 MB and we have available 857 MB so it is good SQL, SQL server is performing well no memory issue so this is the dynamic management view to figure out the memory issue with SQL server or not so thanks for watching SQL guide please share subscribe and like my channel